Thank you for joining us at webvitamins.com. If you'd like to order, you can come to webvitamins.com or call us at 800-919-9122. Today we're going to talk about acetyl L-carnitine. Acetyl L-carnitine is actually just a form of carnitine. Acetyl L-carnitine and L-carnitine can, can form each other. You can form L-carnitine from acetyl L-carnitine or you can form acetyl L-carnitine from L-carnitine. The carnitines, which uh, acetyl L-carnitine is a part of, help with lipid metabolism and energy production in the body. Conditions that are frequently thought of when treated with uh, acetyl L-carnitine include Alzheimer's disease and cognitive impairment. Also, male infertility and testosterone deficiency due to aging can be treated with acetyl L-carnitine, usually combined with a little L-carnitine. Also, acetyl L-carnitine has been used for patients with diabetic neuropathy and also Peyronie's disease. Adverse and drug interactions related to acetyl L-carnitine. There are actually very few uh, adverse or reactions other than minor or stomach or GI discomfort that are associated with acetyl L-carnitine. However, uh, people with hypothyroidism need to be careful. Um, the L-carnitine seems to inhibit the hormone, the thyroid hormone in certain areas of the body, so it's possible that acetyl L-carnitine may also in, and worsen hypothyroidism. Also, people with seizures uh, can be made worse with L-carnitine, and uh, acetyl L-carnitine could also worsen seizures. Um, two of the drugs that are affected by acetyl L-carnitine are Cintron, uh, or uh, Coumadin or Warfarin. These drugs can actually be made to be more effective by acetyl L-carnitine in increasing their anticoagulant effect. So you have to be incredibly cautious when combining them with the drugs because they can cause you to bleed too much. So shouldn't be combined with those two drugs. There's also some other drugs that can actually be that can actually cause deficiencies or reduce levels of uh, acetyl L-carnitine. And some of those include uh, Accutane, um, Dilantin, Depakote, and uh, so there's a few that actually might not be a bad idea adding some acetyl L-carnitine to make up for the deficiency that it can create in your body. Dosages used uh, in acetyl L-carnitine are anywhere from 500 to 4,000 milligrams per day. People with Alzheimer's disease usually take anywhere from 1,500 to 4,000 milligrams. Um, infertility in males is usually treated with 1,000 milligrams of uh, acetyl L-carnitine plus 2,000 milligrams of L-carnitine. Um, diabetic neuropathy is usually treated with anywhere from 1,500 to 3,000 milligrams per day and Peyronie's disease is treated with usually 1,000 milligrams per day. We thank you for joining us on this presentation on acetyl L-carnitine. You can order at webvitamins.com or call us at 800-919-9122. Thank you.